Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Ashes of the Past. And as Yugoslavia, it is time to restore some order to the world. As Jewish Yugoslavia, that is. <laughs> but um, as you guys know, we're setting our target on Austria over here. 31st of March of next year, we will be taking them on. However, there's a slight chance we might be having our butt handed to us. And that's because they've decided to go fascist. This is not so good. <laughs> this is not good at all. Uh, but on the bright side, it does give us time to build up our fuel and just keep, uh, keep, keep trading these divisions so I can actually have foot infantry, which means I can actually have, you know, proper equipment, proper individuals, proper everything leading the charge. So without further ado, I'll see you when I'm next available or next free to. Uh, but until then... Uh... We'll have to wait. We'll have to wait. See you guys soon. Okie dokie. So it seems like this war came around a lot quicker than what I thought it was. That ticker goes down so goddamn quick. But without further ado, let's... Wait, hold on. What? You've gone fascist, but you want to stand with the Warsaw Pact? Austria, it's for your own... It's for your own benefit that Yugoslavia takes you at this point. Because you don't even know what you're doing yourself. Uh, Klagenfort into Graz. There we go. Fantastic. You... I want you to go up past Klagenfurt and then all the way over here, Innsbruck, and then all over here in the corner. And then the other guy, Klagenfurt, all the way up into Vienna and across the river. Hopefully this goes well. Fingers crossed. Oh, God. Look, my units are awful. My units are genuinely so goddamn bad. I just don't understand why these units are so bad. Is it because they're ill-equipped? I just don't know. I genuinely... Look, 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 look. Look, this is awful. This is atrocious. How am I supposed to, to deal with this? How? I genuinely want to know how. How 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 is one expected to deal with this? This is ridiculous. This is utterly ridiculous. How we they don't even last a second in battle. How can it be expected of me to deal with that? Oh, it's madness. Utter bloody madness. Vienna Vels Linz, go. Graz in a Salzburg. Just go. Like that in a Vienna. Can we just get the job done, please, for crying out loud? There we go. And with that peace treaty finalized and Austria out of the game, we can finally round up divisions after that war, put them on the Bulgarian border, because I had enough XP to finally form a blooming infantry division. Oh my goodness gracious, it's a goddamn blessing. I am so grateful and so happy that I can finally make infantry. Oh my god, the most underrated form of manpower ever. <laughs> Let's put the beauties in uniform to good use. Uh, just have a little bit of idea what our equipment are they using. So support weapons, uniforms, man pads, light motorized. Yeah, so basically a lot of stuff that I don't really have. And we're going to need to get factories for... We didn't really get many factories out of Austria, did we? That's fine. We can always, you know, develop that in the future. Let's get illuminated optics whilst we're here. Produce them. Oh, honestly, guys, I cannot express the joy that I'm feeling right now to be able to say, yes, yes, I have infantry. And so what? <laughs> oh, the joy is surreal. The joy is surreal. There we go. Let's get mills as well. But I want civvies to help speed things up. What uh, am I on? I'm still on civvy. I'm literally still on... Oh, because I need the senator system. I need the senator system to be able to... Right, requires the support of at least 58 senators and 261 reps. So where is my whole party system? How does one uh, uh, purge opposition? I, I can't even do that. How, how does one control the their, their, their council thing? Th there's a thing here. I know there's a thing, but I don't know where the thing is. I'm going to find it. I will find that's that's no that's not it that that's that's really not it uh I'll find it eventually I'll find it eventually also it seems like the first Gulf War has just kicked off Saddam Hussein's just been like hey QA nice to meet you be a shame if something happened to you uh also it, it seems like the US are gonna do nothing about it so ripperoni QA to Roni oh dearie me I'm just happy that I've got infantry dude <laughs> And now that I've got my infantry division, there we go. There we go. Led by, hmm, who's going to be the first infantry commander of the Yugoslav army? We're going to go for Nebojša Pavkovic. 
Come on, Nabuisa. Let's go here. Fantastic. Hey, Italy. Bye, Italy. <laughs> oh, fantastic. Let's go. Let's take out the origins of Rome. This is the new Roman Empire. We call it Jugoslavia Romoslavia. There we go. Makes no sense, but screw it. We're rocking with it. You know, guys, I've just noticed Yugoslavia is quite honestly about to become the powerhouse of Europe. Warsaw Pact has lost most of its territory since they're all going fascist. Same with NATO. This is interesting. Like, Republic of Italy is trying to go towards the Warsaw Pact. Dude, Yugoslavia is about to be the most powerful nation in the goddamn world, aside from Russia and China. Yeah, goddammit, Yugoslavia, let's go. <laughs> this is fantastic. Oh, absolutely fantastic. I just need to get equipment for my armies to be competent, and we're just going to be absolutely fine. Let's wait until next month, and then after we've done that, we're going to start striking east. This is brilliant. This is the best gift anyone could ask for. <laughs> oh, dearie me. No way. Wait, hold on. What? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. What is going on right now? <laughs> so, I have no idea what's happened, but Russia have... No divisions, no navy, no air force. They've gone autocratic, so they've kicked out the commies. They're in a relationship with Cyprus. But that doesn't end there. China is a big boy, nice and thick, but no, no infantry, no nothing. Although they've got factories to make it happen. And then there's the USA, under Ronald Reagan. But they're going national. <laughs> they're going nationalist. They have no army, no navy, no air force. Oh my good god. Guys, I think it's time. We've we, we got a challenge. Before, I was just going to go all of Eastern Europe and North Africa and sort of the Levant. But no, we're going bigger. We're going way bigger. We're going for a Yugoslavia one tag. Let's get it. Let's get it. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. It's time to declare... Can't even English. It's time to declare war on Oscar Luigi Scalfaro's Italy. Declare that war, big boy. We've got the infantry doing the work and these guys doing absolutely nothing in, in actually blocking the attack. But let's go and see what we can do. I also want to set these guys... Oh, no, no. I'm sending the wrong people to attack. There you go. I want the infantry to do the attacking. Uh, yeah, let's set the goals like that. Go, 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 my brethren. March. Like that into Venice. Send you guys down into Milan, into Torino, and then into Genoa. Oh, my God. La Spezia, Firenze, Livorno. Let's take it out. Let's take it out. Dearing me. Croatia declares independence. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Oh, no, it's the Yugo War. Yugoslavia has been... Hold on. I did not prepare for this at all. I did not prepare for this at all. Uh, okay. So they're at war with Serbia. But Serbia is yet to be born because I'm still Yugoslavia. Right, listen, guys. The world's a mess. We need to finish this war so we can eat Italy and then deal with the Yugo war. Let's go, 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 go. I've got... You, you've got me. Let's be one happy family. Oh my lordy door. Right, guys, I know it looks bad when you look over here, but everything is absolutely fine. Okay, fair enough. They're a little bit close to taking Belgrade, but it doesn't matter. Everything is a-okay. I promise, kind of. Believe in yourself and everything will be just fine, right? That that's That's the kind of mentality we need to have here, okay? Everyone here, focus on that. You guys are doing bits. Fantastic. You guys are doing a fantastic job at cleaning this up. Well done. Be so proud of yourself. Like that. Across the Alps. And then line that back up. You go in there. Fill the hole. You guys come back in. Beep, beep, boop, boop. Brilliant. Oh, God. You've just been halted. You've been halted. That's fine. If you ever get halted, just go around. Just go around. Just go around. Hopefully, this tactic works. I'm keeping my fingers crossed because I don't actually believe in myself. <laughs> Okie dokie, ladies and gentlemen, with that finishing that war, we finally have taken all of uh, all of Italy from the Italians. Now it's time to kind of reschedule our plans because we now have a 10-day war with Slovenia. 
which most likely is not going to go well at all. Uh, so without further ado, let's line up and prepare for this. I am super, super weak as a nation. Uh, all of my units suck. Maybe I'm supposed to fall apart for the for, for the units to actually be semi-decent. Maybe that's the plan. I have no idea. Devs, if you're watching, please give me some advice on that. Because the divisions seem so weak. Like, so incredibly weak. Is it because I didn't go down the Tito path? Is it because I didn't do any of this? That my units are so weak? Like... What, what, what's going on? I'm a little bit, you know, a little bit concerned as to as to why my units are so weak and lackluster. Is it a me thing? Is it a me problem? I'm, I'm not sure. I am kind of like the bug king uh, and the unlucky king when it comes down to hoy. <laughs> oh, dearie me. Let's just take out. There we go. Slovenia's been dealt with. Take all states. Fantastic. It just means I have to deal with Croatia somehow. Bloody Croats. Get in away. Franjo, Fra Franjo Tuchman. God's sake. <laughs> Okie dokie, thank you very much for watching, guys. I greatly appreciate you tuning in to part... I think, what's, what part is this? Two? Three? Part three. Part three of Ashes of the Past. I'm actually enjoying this mod quite a bit now. Um, and hopefully we can find out as to why our units are so weak for some reason. So, thank you very much for watching, guys. Again, if you've enjoyed, don't forget to, of course, click that like button and or subscribe. Share me with your friends, start to grow for the channel. All that fun stuff. And I'll see you in the next episode. Ta-da!